Okay, great. So now I'm going to plug in my USB. Okay, great. So it'll pop up immediately. And double click into launch quick installer. Click yes. Okay, so this will take a couple of seconds. Okay, so just make sure that you've uninstalled um, all previous um, XPS printers. And this is important so that you can continue to install um, your new Sigma onto your desktop. And what you'll do is that you'll go into your um, control panel, okay? And you will then click left on it and remove the device, okay? So obviously, as you can see, I've installed it quite a few times, so I can uninstall it over here and I'll just say remove device. OK, so I don't need a copy of this device. Um, so I'll just remove the device. Great. So I've already installed the Sigma, so I don't need copies of it. Um, so I'll click next. And I'm not going to install it because I've already done it with the USB. Um, so I'm just going to click install, I'm going to click accept, click next. Okay, so I'm going to use the ethernet, okay. Um, so you'll connect using your ethernet cable um, and connection port that they've given you in your box. So this is mainly just the USB port that you'll connect to your printer. And um, I've entered my, I've got my USB um, IP address get your IP address, sorry, by going into your devices, um, clicking left on it and going into printer properties, go into ports. Okay, great. So copy three. Um, so I'm going to say configure port and here's your IP address as well. Okay. And um, I'm going to now put it in. Okay. So um, please remember to write your IP address down. So I'm going to click install. OK, so it is already installed, which is great. OK, great. So now um, thanks for installing the driver. You will now be directed to the printer dashboard. Um, use a shortcut to launch the printer dashboard. Press done to close the installer. Okay, so I'll click done.